gun ammunition shortage is being felt across the country. Local gun shops say in recent months the shortfall has gotten so intense they simply can't keep up with demand. ABC 12's Kristen Abraham live now from Bay County's Linwood with the story. Kristen? Hi, Angie. One gun expert says that he's never seen anything like this. He's gotten calls as far as Texas and California looking for ammo. One big reason, they say, for the shortage is fear. It's a nationwide crisis. Don Beaver at Frank's Great Outdoors in Linwood can't keep firearm ammunition on his shelves. It's instantly gone. I get a little bit in. The first guy sees it. He takes everything we have. There's none for the next guy. It's a trend being fired off at gun shops nationwide. Experts say it's fear sparking so-called stockpiling. Fear is a pretty big motivator. Um, not knowing what's going to happen. There's a lot of rumors running that, you know, the administration is going to make changes to X law or XYZ law. You hear that, you're a gun enthusiast, you're going to react. I've heard talk that there could be quite an increase in the taxes on ammunition and uh, been aware of it. Haven't purchased any ammunition to get ahead yet or anything like that, but have, it has crossed my mind that it's something I might want to do. Gary Lalonde of Standish may be out of luck. He's looking for a specific kind. I can't find it at Frank's and I can't find it in Bay City at Walmart's and I can't find it at Dunham's in Saginaw or Gander Mountain because there is none. The shortage may force the veteran hunter to reload his own ammunition. It's going to be a long weekend for me because we like the target practice and I don't know what we're going to do. Franks tell me it's only a matter of time of when the manufacturer will hike up the price on ammo. Gun sales are also up 50 percent from last year. Reporting live in Lidwood tonight, Kristen Abraham, ABC 12 News. Kristen, thank you. These are basically the, the ones that are in shortest supply. If you own one of these and you're looking for these, you may be out of luck. Those companies are filling military contracts and then contracts for the police and other people first and then retailers. Well this is what gun owners will find in most stores. This is the section for the handgun ammunition and as you can tell it's pretty empty. Retailers expect to fill that in from time to time but there won't be a huge supply of ammo for about 90 days. It's a national trend. Ammunition companies report an increase in demand that began last fall. Another trend? Higher gun sales. FBI background checks are required to buy firearms Data shows the number of checks jumped more than 29 percent from March 2008 to March 2009. Experts say background checks are a strong indicator of firearm sales. I think the increase in demand for both firearms and ammunition is directly attributable to gun owner concerns regarding the current political climate. That political climate won't change before the next national election. The good news for handgun owners, ammunition, is expected much sooner. There will be plenty. It's not a, an issue of that it won't be available. It's just it may take a little while. In Carbondale, Dana J, News 3.